Hey, I'm Cheryl. Hi, I'm Eli. How are you? I'm all right, thank you. How are all you? All right, you've been training, so yeah. nice and hot. Yeah. So how did you get involved in basketball? Um, well, I mean, like, growing, growing up, I always had, like, my one friend, Jared. Uh, he always played basketball, and one day when I was over, he was like, do you want to go down to the backyard and shoot a few hoops? And I was like, yeah, right, why not? And um, that's where I fell in love with the game. So how long have you been playing? Playing. Like, what age were you... Uh, well, when I first started playing, like, in a competitive game, yep. that was probably about six years ago now. Okay. And uh, when I just first started playing, I was probably, like, seven or eight years ago, so, long time. Yeah. So, did you do any other sports? Oh, um, uh, I was mainly, like, into soccer or... back then. Okay. Yeah, that got old, so. Yeah. Now I'm into this. But basketball's, um... Basketball's staying around. Found you. Yeah. Found your spot. Yeah. Yeah. So what do you like about basketball? It's a tough question. You just, I just love how uh, you can really make mistakes and everyone will just keep going. Like you won't really get picked at that much. Sometimes you will get picked at, but um, that's just how it is. I love all the teamwork in it. It's for like later later on in life. You know, you're going to need teamwork for whatever you go into. So that's always a good key thing to have. Yep. So do you currently play with the team at the moment? Uh, yeah, I play with Oswish. I also play at school and I play some club here and there. Okay, so you're at school. What grade are you in? I'm 11 going into 12. Going into 12 next year. Yeah, it is yep. the end of the year. Yep. Um, so you do into school sport? Yep, I do into school with all the AIC competitions. Okay, so there's um, quite a good basketball yep. program. Yeah, um, around. Yep, with, within the school. Yep. So do you see basketball as something um, you would like to do further down the track? Definitely. Like career-wise or just um, um, at the moment? Yeah, maybe for like, I don't know about the career part, but maybe for the next few years, maybe like after when I'm a bit older, I might get into coaching, just some like little league teams or something. Right. That would always be fun, so yeah. Yeah. Have you met any basketball players? I've met pretty much like this year's Brisbane Bullets team. That was fun. Uh, I met them through the Oswish thing that we did when we went down there and we visited Nissan Arena, had a tour of that facility and at games I've also said hello and I've seen Nathan Sobe around a lot, so. Okay, Yeah. so you've seen um, a couple of Bullets games? Yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 certainly the live experience yeah. is it's, pretty it's good, isn't it? Definitely good. Um, uh, so what position do you play on the court? I uh, mainly play guard this year. I'm trying to push into point guard more than I am, just both guard spots. Okay. So, yeah. yeah, I just play point guard now, so it's very fun. And so you have you found Oswish um, a good program? Def most definitely, yeah. For three years now, it's been great. Good thing I've ever put my money into. It's a good group of yeah. um, guys. Yeah. I mean, we've been involved in it for a few years. Um, and everybody, I love the way everyone encourages yeah. each other. Definitely. And like you say, you know, they'll pick you up if you're doing something wrong. Yeah. Um, but, you know, no one's, no one's Harsh picking about it. Anyway. Yeah. You're, it's to, to help each other learn yeah. and grow. Yeah. So your future, if it's maybe not basketball, um, what do you do? You have any future goals um, in what well, you might like to do? Future goals. Well, like trying to. Be, uh, right now, I'm trying to get into my first team for school, and uh, that's going to be a long journey, but I'm ready for it. Um, ready to tackle it head on. Yeah. Cool. And uh, lay down the path, hoping to become a carpenter in life. A carpenter. Yeah. Huh? So that's, that's going to be very fun. Yeah, so you like using your hands? Yeah, I've always, like, uh, ever since grade seven when I first got introduced to, like, woodwork and metalwork and stuff, I've just loved it ever since. I think it's one of those things that you're either, people are either good with their hands or they're not yeah. good with their hands. Some people are good with the brain, others yeah. are good with the hands. Favourite player? Doesn't matter whether it's overseas. Ooh, um, um, do you have a favourite player or two? I have uh, I have two favourite players. I have sure. Kyrie Irving and Kobe Bryant. I learn uh, I learn a lot from those two. Just the way that they uh, play the, their positions and the way they can manage the floor very easily. Yep. Training. Do you like training? Yeah, non non summer you... though. Non Summer's summer too hot. So hot. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, so no, it's why is good. training important? Why not just shoot around a couple of times at home and then go play games? Oh uh, well, training you more you get more interactive with your team. I guess you can like figure out what they do best and what they don't do best. So when it comes to game time situations, you can tell like, yeah, they're definitely gonna make that shot or maybe not them, but maybe the center in the post, just give it to him. He's definitely gonna make that. Yep. So you can just tell on game day, much more easier to win.
yeah, you can learn to read your yeah. read your players and yeah. know what moves are going to be. And and if the case is there for you to be in that position to yeah. um, to take the ball or yeah. or pass the ball or Definitely. whatever, um, court vision is important. Yes, yeah, very important in my position. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I always make sure when I'm coming down the floor, like um, Craig says, to keep an eye on the rim. That way you can see the whole floor and yeah. you can know where people are. So, yeah. Uh, if you could play on a team, yeah. what team would you like to play with your favourite player or would you like to play against them? Uh, I'd mainly play here in Australia and hopefully for the Bullets just because it's close to home. Don't have to you know, go that far. It's still yeah. here in Australia. It's still at yeah. home. So, yeah. yeah, that'd be much more better than over overseas anywhere. That's right. Stick with home first yeah. and you never know down the track. Thanks again for being here. We hope you enjoyed this video and learning about some of our Auswish athletes' goals and dreams. Feel free to leave your dreams in the comments below and hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. We had a lot of fun making it. We hope to see you in the next one.